Hi everyone, this is Danny for Do Tech and welcome back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about some great news that I want to share with you guys. First of all, I'm going to be talking about the jailbreak status for the iOS 10.3 up to iOS 10.3.3, which is I'm going to be talking about in Discover Meridian jailbreak status and the next thing, which is going to be really amazing news about that is a new exploit will be released for the iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 so let's go ahead and get it started okay so first of all I'm gonna be talking and discover the uh, the uh, jailbreak status for the Meridian so Meridian as everybody knows it is a uh, really nice and good jailbreak for the 64-bit devices running the iOS 10 uh, point three up to iOS 10.3.3 but the thing about the Meridian is still there is no substrate on it and still there is no Cydia so the good thing is right now the uh, developer of Meridian he already tweeted and he was talking about it is a passable in a few days the Cydia will be showed up on that jailbreak and there is going to be a substrate for that jailbreak once we have the both which is going to be the Meridian really amazing if you want to use your 10.3 uh, up to iOS 10.3.3 your 64-bit devices and you will be jailbreak your device with Meridian as everybody knows we have right now the Goblin jailbreak if you are right now on 64-bit devices on the iOS 10.3 up to iOS 10.3.3 but the thing is about Goblin it didn't has that much range of uh, support devices but the thing is if you want to go to Meridian website here and by the way right now we are on the uh, beta 6 and the, the thing about the Meridian it has a lot of range of support devices as you guys can see here even there is a lot of people they still waiting they have the iPhone 7 7 plus and they want that jailbreak in their devices since we uh, see the release from the uh, look at the disco which is the yellow jailbreak the only uh, most the devices on the iPhone 7 they get that jailbreak on the 10.1.1 but the thing is is not a stable and nobody use it so right now the hope it's all about Meridian if Meridian is gonna be work with the substrate with Cydia we will be see that jailbreak even is gonna be work for iPhone 7 and the 7 plus pretty much that information it's all about Meridian it's gonna be really good and nice information and news about that uh, jailbreak status if we have in near future the substrate and even the CDA will be working which is gonna be really amazing so here is the uh, developer Twitter which is I'm gonna be leave and a link will be in the description down below if you want to follow up with him if you want to support him and even if you want to check any other news with him on his Twitter okay so let's jump right now talking about the iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 so as Imperium here, this is their Twitter account, which is I'm going to be leave for you guys in the description down below if you want to follow up, if you want to check about any kind of information or a news about it, there is a new possible uh, new exploit will be released and it's going to be recover the uh, iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 what does that mean this is gonna be a jailbreak this is gonna be a hope for a jailbreak in the near future for the people who already still on the iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 this is the hope here and this is gonna be great news for you guys if you want to jump on Zimperium here website and about the exploit is not published yet, is not public yet, but the most information that we can found here in Zimperium uh, website here, which is I'm going to be leave for you guys in the description down in the video, uh, you can read it, you can go through about all the information and that company here is going to be release that exploit, which is going to be pretty soon. Let me jump right now here to see which from where 
digital sign in from Apple so if you are already on iOS 11.2.5 you can go ahead and downgrade right now as far as Apple is still sign in the iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 so if you are you want to stay on iOS 11.2 that's gonna be really amazing that's gonna be giving you the chance to jailbreak your device in the near future if you are already on the iOS 11.2.1 stay there whenever the time whenever always you stay on a lower version is gonna be giving you that option in the near future if you want to jailbreak your device and that's gonna be maybe if that exploit will be released let me talking about something which is gonna be really exciting let me talking about the Electra here so Electra it my the developer of Electra he is gonna be work with that exploit once the exploit will be released so if Zemperium they release that exploit and it's gonna be matched most of the things on the Electra we will be see uh, that is gonna be working on your iOS device you can jailbreak your device with Electra and what I mean here you can download the tweaks and then you can set up some tweaks you can use some theme on your device and that's for sure is going to be support your 64-bit devices no matter what device that you have as far as you running the iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 so pretty much we are right now waiting on Zimperium to release their exploit and publish that in the public and once that's gonna be released most the the uh, developers they're gonna be work on it and as I told you guys is gonna be giving you that option that chance will be in hand once we see that exploit maybe that's gonna be match and it's gonna be work with the Electra which is gonna be providing you with that option to jailbreak your device will not pretty much 100% to jailbreak your device because with Elkla there is no Cydia but at least you can get some tweaks uh, on your device and even you can get some theme in your iOS device so that's the most the information that I have for you guys about the both firmwares which is here uh, first of all I'm talking about the iOS 10 up to iOS 10.3.3 about the Meridium status and the second thing which is going to be about these Imperium which is they going to be released a new exploit will be recovered the iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 any more information if I get something in hand in the near future I will be making sure to post another video and update you guys right away so that's it for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and thanks for watching catch you guys with the next one peace